All right, we're looking at this proof that in any graph, the number of vertices of odd degree is even. So let's take our vertices and say that we have A vertices of even degree. And let's assume that we have B vertices with odd degree. Well, we know that the degree of a vertex is how many edges come out of it. We also know that every edge has two vertices connecting to it. So by the handshake lemma, we know that the degrees of vertices have to add up to be even because degrees equals two times the number of edges. Therefore, degrees, total degrees, so I'm going to do the sum of degrees, sum of degrees is even. All right, well, my sum of degrees is going to be A times, uh, so I have A vertices of even degrees. So my sum of degrees is going to be the sum of my A vertices plus the sum of degrees of my B vertices. Well, I know that A vertices had even degree. So this value is going to be even. This value is even. And I know that, let's shrink this down. So this value is even. This must be even because it's the sum of even numbers. Well, if I have an even number, the only way to make a sum of that ends up being even as well is if this value is even. If I added an odd number, my sum would be odd. So my sum of B degrees must be even, but each of my B vertices had an odd degree. To end up being even, I must have an even number of odd values in order to end up with an even sum. So there must be an even number of odd degree vertices. This proof might uh, require you to think carefully about it, especially because we're using the words even and odd so often. You could think of your evens as multiples of two as well to help you see the even versus odd relationship.